his couch. This is my big comfy couch here at Cena's Dolls. Hello everyone. Hello and welcome back to the big comfy couch. Yes. So I want to say happy Juneteenth. Yes, Juneteenth was actually on yesterday. Um, so I didn't have a chance to come on and make a video, but I did make a short with my two June scopes um, in my short section of this channel. So go check it out. Yes. So happy Juneteenth. Now, before we get started, go ahead and hit the like button. Go ahead and subscribe if you're not already and share this video with your other dolly friends. All right. So, you all, we have, well, I have a video to show you today. It's going to be my sweet nephew came to visit me. <laughs> so, what I want to do is compare this particular big, chunky sculpt to um, a kit that I have here at the house already okay I'm going to get more into that in a few minutes but before I do let me activate Miss Flossie say good morning to Miss Flossie it is early here it's actually um it's not that early actually it's only eight o'clock or, or almost eight o'clock in the morning and I decided to jump on and make a video because I wanted to really look at this particular doll to see what the big deal is, okay? So, I said I might as well go ahead and record a video. So, I was debating on if I wanted to show this particular baby or not on my channel why why I have him but I said hey why not why are not because he has to go back home so I might as well go ahead and document me having this cute baby so without further ado let me show you who of this baby okay so is. let me get him all situated he came with this really nice pretty fluffy blanket it has whales and starfish and little goldfish on it so <laughs> let me show you all who this baby is you guys let me get him together wait a minute wait a minute let me get him together all right oh my goodness here he is Look at this big chunker, 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 baby here, sleeping baby boy. So as you guys can see, yes, this is a pickle. This is a pickle. Yes, this is a pickle, the pickle sculpt by Mickey Johnson. Yes, look at him. So, my dolly sis sent me this pickles. <laughs> her son, her loved, beloved baby. Um, his name is Tommy. So, this is my nephew, Tommy. <laughs> his name is Tommy. And um, she sent him to me because she wants me wanted me to really see um what all the hype is about about the pickles i said to myself really quick here you guys i said to myself i said why would i want another big back baby when i got two big back babies well several big back babies but i recently got two big back babies from her <laughs> No offense about the big back babies. That's just a term that's going around and I think it's hilarious, okay? So, but literally, 
okay this one here is literally a big back baby this is a chunker okay but i do have two other babies that i feel was just as chunky just as big okay as this one so what we're going to do is a comparison we're going to do a comparison of the two kids but look at him this is what she sent in this is how he arrived all bundled up in this cute pajama set is white with blue and green dinosaurs on it and he is just chillaxing okay he's been chillaxing ever since he got here it has been no problem um but before i do the comparison before i really show you all his details i want to show you how this overbearing mother what she sent with him like i wasn't gonna take care of him okay she sent him with this cute outfit this blanket but she sent him all these other clothes like she sent him she packed him up a night bag y'all and she said you better take care of my baby so let me tell y'all Actually, I'm not going to tell you guys who she is until I show you my babies. Then I'm going to tell you guys who she is. Some of you have probably already guessed. But he did have his his head covered. Okay, like box, box opening style presentation. Okay. With this nice diaper. I like these diapers. Really, really soft. So we're gonna put this back in back in order. This diaper he will be using. Okay, this here. And she packed him so many clothes. Oh, let me tell y'all, she packed him a note. She packed him a note too. Okay. So let me read this note that this overbearing mother packed. Hold on, Flossie. It says, Hi Auntie, this is your nephew Tommy. Get it, Tommy Pickles. That's why she named him Tommy, because Tommy's Pickles. I'm sorry. I haven't heard of Tommy's Pickles. Some of you may have, but I haven't. I know Tommy, from nephew Tommy, is a, it's a radio personality here in Atlanta on V103, okay? I mean, no, nephew Tommy's not on V103. He's on the Steve Harvey Morning Show, nephew Tommy. It's on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. That, I don't know that radio show still comes on or not not sure or anyway or tommy off of power i know about tommy i know tommy off of power <laughs> that's what i was thinking about when i first saw him he looked like he could be tommy's baby off of power mm -hmm, sis, something you're not telling me is this that's who the daddy, the daddy is anyway she goes on to say he wanted to come for a visit. He prefers light blue clothes. So I sent so I sent some with him. But you could dress him however you want. Enjoy him for a month or so. Then send him home when Walter is sick of it. <laughs> Thanks. I'm going to go ahead and say who it is. Deja. <laughs> yes, my dolly sis. Deja sent him to me. And Deja is an artist. And I have the baby that you're going to see is from uh, from Deja. That I'm going to do the comparison, actually. But I thought that note was so funny. And I'm going to show y'all what she packed with him. But yes, anywho, <laughs> Deja, okay? Walter is a mess. Walter the one was calling my baby's big bat. He said, what's going on? He said, every time a big bat catastrophe is going on, up in here I'm getting all these big back babies <laughs> anyway <clears throat> okay so this she sent him with this i think that this is so cute this is my first time actually looking at actually looking at what she sent him but she sent him these cute little overall set now this is cute i'm gonna have to take him a picture in this yeah let's see how cute that is she sent him with that and um, she sent them with this cute, like, um, beige and blue striped shirt. This would be cute. That would have been cute for a little Tyler Tuesday thing this past Tuesday. 
she sent him with this this is an all over little um shorts romper i think this is cute light blue i mean like grayish blue grayish blue I meant to say and they're cute the little wooden buttons i think that is adorable then he has this is cute long sleeve little onesie something he could just lay around here with on the comfy couch with Miss Flossy because he likes Miss Flossy. And then he came with this cute little jacket. It's it's hot here in Georgia. He's come from South North Carolina. I'm sorry, North Carolina is hot too. So I don't understand why she packing him all this stuff like this in case he might get a chill. And she packed him these little his little striped pants and these cute little um overalls here cute little um what color is this beige overalls so she packed him a good bag y'all she packed him a good bag we're gonna make sure that he's very well taken care of deja and it was so sweet of her to send him to his auntie sana i've been telling my my dolly sis and friends i'm like send me send me your baby to auntie sana send him to auntie sana and um you know, I just be playing. I know people ain't gonna be sending me their baby. But she actually sent me him. I think this go with this. Is this supposed to go with this Deja? Because it looks like it does. So anyway, she actually sent me her dog, you guys. She sent me her precious pickles. So what I did notice is he is stacked. Okay, when I say stacked, he's heavy. Um, and he's a big boy. So his artist is, if you guys look at his hair, look at his painting. If you haven't guessed, his artist is Deborah Miller. Deborah Miller, she is known for her painted hair. I had a, I had a few babies from Deborah Miller. I had two Ephraim scopes that are no longer with me. I had a, a bountiful babies kit. I forgot the name of it that I no longer have, but I have my twins, um, Gianna and what's her name? The Scopes name, Julie and Gianna Scopes from Chinsadol or from Deborah Miller. And he is, and our Dolly sis over there at, um, our Dolly sis, um, Lisa, Lisa over at, nanny's nursery yes you guys have to go check out her channel she actually have three of these deborah miller big pickle babies yes she does she does she does she does so yeah he's a big chunker he is but um deja sent him to me for me to look at him and look and take a look at um and my um these other the other big baby so i'm gonna do a comparison i'm gonna show you who the other big baby is in a minute i was just looking at him look at him let me move this back so you guys can see his whole big old self look at him so this is a big sculpt he really is let me see Okay, I'm just making sure I said the name right. It is by <laughs> it is by Nikki Johnson. <laughs> but look how cute he is. Look at this picture. That would be a cute little thumbnail. Okay, so let me. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to go ahead and undress him. First, take off his cute little sock. Cute little socky. Look at his feet. Look at the rose on the bottom of his eldest feet. Okay, we're going to take a look at this body because I can tell that this body is a big body. <laughs> big body. He is um very cuddly. She's told me, they just said, you have to see how he holds. You have to see how he holds. So... 
I did and he oh my goodness this coat does hold very very <laughs> well like a real baby look at him I and I'm used to having big babies if you guys check out my community tab look at the picture I posted that was of my daughter Serenity Sky when she was two months old and she was a big chunky baby when she was born, she was born looking like she was three months. Um, she was 10 pounds, 12 ounces. She was huge. So that is why I'm attracted to the big babies. But um, since I had some big babies already, I didn't, I don't see the point of, you know, having another big, chunky funky baby like this and Deja was like no it's not the same you have to you have to um check out this particular sculpt and then I watch Lisa's channel and she has her beautiful pickles and she was just saying there's something about this sculpt that's just amazing amazing so i said okay all right well she she went ahead and just sent him in the mail <laughs> she said look your nephew tommy is on the way i just went ahead and sent him to you i was like what what i didn't expect her to send him um at all and um she sent him she wanted me to experience him so as you guys can see, he has a big poked out stomach here. And this reminds me of the Gushin sculpt by Chenza Doll because the Gushin has the custom made. Um, I'm going to just take this, lift this shirt up. The Gushin has the custom made body for that um, kit. So this one has a custom made body. You can tell by the stitching. Okay, let me come close. The stitching on the body. So, he says on his cute cloth diaper. Oh, let me just take this diaper off of him. Okay, so you can see the stitching of how this body is stitched in a stomach. Look, it's stitched in a stomach here. Look at it here from this side left and right and down here and then it has the little stitched chest here so we're going to turn it around because he also has a bum he has a big old big old butt <laughs> big old cloth butt now you too this is a doll this is not a real baby i don't want to get flagged but look look at the stitch bottom it is a big and then this this body is wide it's extra wide look at it from the side you know how we big girls we don't like to be taking pictures from the side but look the pictures from the side tells everything okay <laughs> it's wide look how wide this is just take a measuring tape to see to, to, to measure the length of this look at that look at that side picture if you really want to see how big you are, take a side picture for real. Look at that. <laughs> That's how I can show you um, oh, how big he is. See, I've n I didn't see that. I didn't see that on the videos that I watch with him. It's this big body along with the limbs. Don't get me wrong. The limbs are big. And the arms have rows. This one has one two three but one two three four rows four big old rows in the in the legs and the legs are short and compacted okay so this is the cuddle factor right here is in this body and if you stuff it with really nice premium cloud polyfill definitely a dream definitely a dream to hold um and some nice glass beads, which he has. Um, it's a dream to hold. That's why I can see why Lisa's addicted to this. Her skulls are from Deborah Miller because this 
baby does have nice quality material in him. So just as important as it is for um, the painting to be nice, it's even more important for the materials that you use in the doll it has to be quality. I'm sorry. It, it has to match all the way around from the material to inside and out. The material that you use as an artist inside and out. Period. Because that's what we want as collectors. You want to make sure that you are doing that because a lot of us open up our dolls and if we see a mess in the inside that's not good and I wouldn't even want that type of <clears throat> reputation as an artist to have not good materials inside your babies but any whom look how adorable he is I'm gonna leave him in his um onesie sleeve look for onesie and bring on the baby that I'm comparing sizes this is a size comparison, not paint or anything like that. This is just um, size comparison. Might get rid of, might get rid of this pillow so you guys can see better. All right, here's my baby, my chunker. Of course, you guys, I was gonna be comparing it to the Jew. The June sculpt. I sure am, because that's what I have. And um, Deja painted this big, beautiful boy for me. Okay. So I was thinking if I already have him and his sister, his sister is a big baby. I mean, it's the same sculpt, but she was put on a bigger body. I'm not going to compare her um, in this video to him neither because she's she's bigger than both of them <laughs> period so i'm gonna take a look at him take his clothes off i'm gonna take off his these shorts so automatically what i notice is the june scope the the limbs are bigger the legs are, are thicker like the thighs are huge way bigger and the length of the legs are bigger. It's just period, the limbs are bigger. No matter what type of body he has on, it, his, the limbs are just bigger than the pickle limbs. See, I didn't know the, I didn't know what the difference was um, or there were a difference. So, but it is. Let me go ahead and um, take, his, take his hat off if he's a baldy. And um, take this top shirt off here. All right. So I took that off and look at him here. So he has on a white tee as well. So the face, the heads are, of the June is bigger than the head of the pickle as well. See? Look at that big old head. <laughs> Bring it in a little closer so you guys can see. So the head is bigger. Even the arms, the arms are bigger. Okay? It's just a big old arm. This arm is big too, but it's more, you know, sculpted. So this is, the difference is, this is hand sculpted by a sculpting artist, okay? Now the June is a baby from a bountiful baby. It's a kit from bountiful babies. And this, the June is a, um, a real born, okay? Which means it's not a reborn. This is a reborn that's hand sculpted by a sculpting artist. And this one is the real born is a kit that is a 3D scan of a real baby. So it's not sculpt. Sculpted is a scan, a 3D scan of a real baby. Okay. So that's the difference between a reborn 
and a real born. Also, but they're both are um, painted by reborn artists. This one has, this was painted by air dry paints and this one is heat set paint. Um, and then this one is um, a force from a, a very, very um, experienced reborn artist has been in, been doing it for years. Deja is a newer artist. She's a newer artist and um, she, her, her painting is more of an ethnic, she paints ethnic babies. And um, so this one here is a beautiful dark, dark um, chocolate complexion. And of this one here, Deborah Miller, she's, um, she does paint ethnic dolls, because I had two ethnic dolls from Deborah Miller, actually. The, those Ephraim scopes that I no longer have, but she mostly concentrates on Caucasian babies with painted hair. And Deja, she roots her, um, her baby's hair. So this is him. So his body is the regular Bountiful Baby's body. And this is not a, a custom body at all. It's not a custom body. That it does have, it does have like the little stitch chest. But you guys know when I showed you this baby, how it had like this, the stitches, the stitching in the body, like here, here to create that stomach. This one, it does not have that. And it's flat on the side. So you look on the side, it's not that big stomach at all. It does have like the, um, oh, this one doesn't even, it has a tiny bottom. It's not like a big stitch bottom on this doll neither. Um, so this baby's um, body is definitely a great quality stitched customized body. Okay, I just wanted to show the two comparisons of the um, kit. Now, you could buy a body, uh, a, a different type of body than this one, but his body came with the kit. That's the body that comes with this actual Pickles kit, which is part of, which is one of the main parts of the cuddle factor. So, if you have a Pickles, you want to make sure that you have that kit, the body with it, with that kit. Um, you want to make sure because I think that that's going to, if you have a pickles and you don't have that body, I think that that's not going to give you, um, it's still going to be a nice doll, don't get me wrong, but that's not the whole kit together. If somebody were to say, say you the kit without the body, that would be a disjustice to me on the whole kit because that this body is custom for this particular kit. So what I'm going to do is put them on some matching outfits because they're cousins. You guys remember when you go to your cousin's house, you have outfits the same or you like to dress the same or like or whatnot. So they're going to have these cute little Hawaiian shorts and they're both the same size. They're, they're six to nine month sizes and these shirts, cute little beach sleeveless shirts. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on them. I'm not gonna do it on camera. Just gonna All put right, on. look how cute they look in their outfits. I just thought of something. This looks like the theme for Toddler Tuesday. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw Toddler Tuesday this week in there because it was beach side. Um, Toddler Tuesday, and this is something that you will wear to the beach or on vacation or something like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw Toddler Tuesday, even though I already made I already made a Toddler Tuesday video. But I didn't do this one, this thing, which was um, beach side. Is it beach side or pool side? I think it was beach. No, it was beach side. And it actually has a beach on the picture with the palm trees. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and throw Toddler Tuesday in here. And Toddler Tuesday this week um, is hosted by Renee at Renee's Reborn. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and throw in this one too. Okay, and I just tagged tag Renee in this one um but yes this is what they look like in the same outfit the same size and everything see his pants is his pants are tighter <laughs> on the oh yeah on these 
thighs. Because it's six to nine months. I will not buy him a six to nine month outfit. Size outfit. The size outfit. Let me see what size this outfit is that I just took off of him. You know what? It is a six to nine months. I am buying him six to nine months. This was six to nine months. I thought it was 12. So it's not a 12 month. Okay, so I am buying him six to nine. I'm about to go for with a bigger size. And then his this outfit that I just took off of him that his mommy sent him in is six to nine months too. Oh, okay. All right, so both of them are um, six to nine months, but he can wear a bigger size. But as you guys can see, these the pants, the shorts look is tighter on his legs, and then on him, I think that the pants are the shorts are fine. I don't know why I keep saying pants. The shorts are fine, space, and everything. But the shirt, oh, it's flossy, Miss Flossy over here. But the shirt, it it do fit, but it's look more fitted on um nephew tommy over here because nephew tommy has that big stomach <laughs> that stomach is like overpowering his head almost see um it's just this big stomach here and this one here um devin i forgot to tell you guys his name this is devin all right so devin he doesn't have that stomach so his more flat. Okay, this one just has a pop belly, like he, he like he just drink a lot of those cereal bottles. We have to put cereal in his bottle so he can sleep harder. <laughs> yes, but look at his little feet. He has like these little um, glazed toenails, gloss toenails. You guys can't see it, but I ain't gonna pick up his heavy self. So, yes. Oh, and I was going to say, too, I love the way his face is scoped with his chunky cheeks, these big lips. I think he has big lips and a pudge nose. Yeah. So, yeah, these are the two cousins. And that's the comparison. That's That's what I found. That's what I found. So... Do I have to have a Pickles? How am I feeling about that? I don't, I'm still kind of not knowing because if I just have to have one because this June, it, the June scope, this beautiful boy and his sister, they actually give me the big baby, the big sleeping baby feel, but they don't have this body and they're not scoped it which is a, a different too and i like how they made this this scope is scoped it like the fingers the um the dimples and the knuckles so i don't even think he has he has little dimples but i, I do love the way this scoped is even the little feet and everything so yes i probably am going to i mean they're they're sold out i mean I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if I will be bringing home a pickles or not. So, anywho, I want to go. Want to thank you, Deja, so very much for sending me my nephew Tommy. I really appreciate it. He is a joy to have, and I will take very good care of him. To end this video, thank you guys so much for tuning in to my videos. Make sure that you guys do like the video. So this is the end of the video. Stay blessed because you are. Be safe out there. And we will be back for another video.